First, uh, what we're gonna do next is actually to check the poses, right? So this is exciting, right? So let's collapse this for now. And, and yeah, so first let's bring in the poses that we've created for our Athena rig, right? So let's go to File Manager and let's import that. So go to Universal and choose this. First, let's choose these five poses, right? So let's import that and let's collapse our file manager. And first, let's move this back to the rest pose, right? So that is our rest pose. So now, since we have set up our profile and adapter manager uh, accordingly, the only thing that we have to do right now is to check this checkbox adapter. Right, so let's check that. And now let's test our poses, right? So this is our body pose rest. And right now you will see right away that the rest pose is kind of do that. That makes the the ring rig cast an A pose right there, just like here. So that's the first thing, right? So the next thing, let's, let's check our uh, Pose one. So this is the post one, right? And this is the post one in the, the original rig there, right? They are, they look great, right? So let's check post two and post two. Great, they look uh, great, right? So post three and post three. Great, right? They look similar. And pose four, there, right? They look something like that, and they are great, right? So now let's check pose five. Okay, right now, this is how it's supposed to look, right? So right now we've got a slight difference, especially on the on the hand area. However, the first thing that we're gonna do, I think, is to to change the IK to FK because this is actually the IK control. So uh, let's change that, right? So, uh, well, now this is actually look a little bit worse, right? So that's not how it's supposed to be because this is where it should be. This is where the IK should be right above the knee, right? Meanwhile, this is something like that. So what's happened? Well, the thing is, the first thing to fix this kind of IK fiasco, we're gonna start using uh, our precision tab right here. And to use that, you just have to check the arm, the left arm and the right arm, right? And it will turn blue, right? So the next thing is that if you've unchecked this button, right? The checkbox, enable precision, something like that. Right now, let's turn it on, right? So. Yeah, that's it. That's how to use precision. And precision is basically offset for IK controls, right? So, so yeah, now it's turned on. Now let's go back to our poses and let's reload our pose five. And there you go. Now it still look bad, but if you notice that the location of the, the IK hand is already very close to the to the knee, right? So we just have to do that, something like that. Also, we just have to tweak the. I think this is personal, right? So you can tweak the the knee so that it's kind of a uh, a little bit to the middle, and you can tweak the arm, sorry, the hand. I mean, and make it make sure that they are resting right on top of the of the knee. Right, so that looks something like that. And now what we have to deal with is the, the, the pole. So because it's kind of a kind of piercing the skin, right? So let's bring it a little bit to the side, something like that. And also this one, something like that. So yeah, this thing now looks just like that, isn't it? So, okay, now we've tweak this, right? We've edited this to fit the rig better. So right now, let's recreate, let's save the pose. 
this, uh, I mean like the edited version of the post. And you can do that with this button, save post. And let's call it something like rain uh, kneeling 001. And voila. Now if you check, if you go to the rest post and then go to this, uh, first you just to uncheck the adapter and just click this. And now they are great. Now this thing looks just like that one. So now uh, we can go on checking the other poses. I think maybe this is uh, actually a little bit of show off, right? So let's import uh, the remaining poses, the body pose, and go import, right? So there, there is the sixth to the tenth body pose, and we can do the same here, right? So you can do that uh, sixth to the tenth. So yeah, let's reload that. Uh, let's load post. Uh, first, check on the adapter again. Post six. Now, again, you just have to kind of a uh, uh, turn off the the IK, right? So now that is the post six, and this is how post six look like. They are very similar, right? So they are exactly. They're not exactly the same. Of course, different body, different rig will have slightly looking different, right? So, yeah. So let's go to post seven. This is post seven. This is post seven, right? Post seven and post eight. That's something like holding a sword right there, right? And they are cool, right? And post nine, <laughs> well, this is our sitting poses that we've created earlier, right? So they, they look great on the rain rig, right? So this is pose nine, right? Uh, sorry, that is now pose 10, right? And now it looks like that she's holding a spear to kind of stab something, right? And they look, they look great, yeah. Yeah, I think that's, that's a little bit of a show off. It takes a little bit of time, but it's kind of worth it now because we show off the, the power of the post-transfer power of the universal version. And 